Our city is giving renters a better chance at becoming a homeowner. WMAR 2 News' Jeff Morgan was there as the historic bill was signed into law. Renters in Baltimore now have a better shot at becoming homeowners thanks to a bill sponsored by Councilwoman Odette Ramos. The bill was championed by former council president Mary Pat Clark. This is so important to so many people. The bill requires landlords planning on selling a property to offer it to the renter before listing it on the open market. The tenant has 14 days to say to sign a letter of intent saying that they do want to move forward with the purchase and then they will go through the contract process. The bill even has protections for the renter if a landlord sets the price way too high to avoid going through this process and can't get that price on the open market. If the purchase price drops by more than 10%, the landlord has to give the tenant another chance to buy the home. There was an exemption put in that if a landlord put it on the market, they wouldn't have to follow this. So it never happened. So we took that out. You have to follow these, um, and we did work with all parties to make sure that um, that this was going to work. The majority of homes in Baltimore are rented. According to the 2020 census data, only 48% are owner-occupied, nearly 20% less than the national average. Baltimore homeowners spend more a month than the average renter in the city, according to the census, though owning a home is considered to be one of the best ways to build wealth by Habitat for Humanity. I want every resident in Baltimore to have the tools that will help them feel empowered to buy a lasting place to call home. The bill won't go into effect for another six months. In Baltimore, Jeff Morgan, WMAR, 2 News.